Hey dudes and dudettes, um, it's Cooper. I want to show some of the things I got uh, recently at garage sales and I stopped at the um, a thrift store on the way home. I was half price for some of these things today but not this. Start off with the uh, Bacon Wave. It's uh, still in the box. Um, cooks uh, bacon in your microwave. These run on eBay for around $10 plus ten dollars shipping or twenty dollars free shipping either way it works about the same uh... then i got this uh... This is some sort of pill dispenser has uh... things lecithin and uh... beet complex anyway uh... reason i picked it up it looks like it's from the sixties which i'm pretty sure it is and uh... Mark 50 cents. It's marked 50 cents upside down, and it was a quarter today. Same thing for this. Uh, some of these things will need cleaning, as you can see. Uh, the green tags were also half price today. Uh, got this plastic napkin holder. This also looks like it's from the 60s. I don't really know what these will go for, but. Uh, uh, I'll probably list them at ten dollars and go from there. And I got this uh, K cup carousel holds twenty seven cups. This was three dollars today, and these run. These are also like the Bacon Wave, uh, like ten dollars and ten dollars shipping or twenty dollars free shipping. I'll probably just list it with the free shipping, so that way they can't complain about the shipping if you do that on eBay. Then I got this twelve bottle wine rack. All the pieces are in there. It's marked four dollars, so I got it for two. This will run about thirty-five dollars on Amazon. All the pieces and the uh, instructions are in there. Oh, and then I got at a garage sale. Got like two bags of Army Men, different colors. Uh, One dollar for all those. There's probably uh, two to three hundred pieces there. They won't bring as much as I was hoping, but I should still get about $15 or so on eBay. Then for myself, I got this shirt, $1.50. But uh, winter's coming, so I need some long sleeves, so got that while I was there. Now this interesting uh, item, this is a Little League Rawlings, Little League Catcher's Mask and um, Helmet. One piece, see it snaps on right there. Uh, if it's been used, it's been used, but not much. I mean, on the leather, it's that's all like new. And uh, a couple little scuffs on the um, helmet. That whole rig was uh, eight dollars, so four dollars. This will sell, I believe, on Amazon, which is probably where I'll sell it for around sixty to seventy dollars so that's a nice little profit and this piece is a face guard for the helmet it's never been uh, hooked on but I'll just probably throw this in it was two dollars and somebody had originally paid thirteen for it and maybe marked down to ten dollars but still I'll just throw it in with that and I should be able to get my uh, seventy dollars or so then I got some Fitz and Floyd cows. Um, surprise, I, I never really saw these before, but I looked them up and uh, usually I paid a dollar for each of these, even though it's marked two. Uh, that's the creamer. Yeah, cream comes right out of her, uh, her mouth. And uh, bet it's missing the lid. And this is the sugar and it's got the lid and a little sugar spoon in there and those will run probably as a set hopefully somebody has the lid they need that piece I may just break it up that's probably the thing I'll do and uh, it has a set to go 25 to 30 dollars on eBay and I noticed when I got home uh, the salt and pepper shakers however I'm missing one of them. <laughs> so I gotta go back down there and get the other one. I don't know how I did that. I think I was going to leave the creamer 
And then I, th I decided I was going to get it and set the uh, pepper shaker back down and or the salt. I can never tell which is which. Does it make a difference? Anyway, uh, like I said for those three pieces, well, four with a salt and pepper shaker. Actually, they'll sell on uh, eBay. I'm saying without the lid, maybe forty dollars, forty to fifty. And then I got some uh, DVDs for a dollar each at the garage sale yesterday. The in Bruges. I hope I pronounced that right. Anyway, it's supposed to be a very good movie. Being John Malkovich. Invasion of the Body Snatchers. I really like that one. Beautiful Girls. Uh, never seen it. Don't know anything about it. But it does have some beautiful girls to sit for Rosie O'Donnell in there. But I uh, don't know what she's doing there. But Natalie Portman. Mira Sorvina. Uh, Sorvino, excuse me. Huma Thurman. Uh, then Mafia. The comedy you can't refuse. But uh, Jay Moore, Lloyd Bridges, Olympia Dukakis, and Christina Applegate. Anyway, I'll watch it. It's only a dollar. I'll get rid of it. Uh, another movie, Orange County, I've never heard of. But Colin Hanks and Jack Black. I like those guys all right. So maybe all right. Love Actually is supposed to be really good. Uh, the Ultimate Romantic Comedy. I don't know if it's The Ultimate, but check it out. What Women Want. Helen Hunt and Mel Gibson. So, and these DVDs are all like new. I bet they were only watched one time. Now here's one. Uh, Shaft. That was a big movie in the uh, early 70s. A black black exploitation movie. I hope I pronounced that correctly. Anyway, uh, but the theme from Shaft by Asia Kays won uh, the Academy Award for the best song. And it was also nominated for best... Uh, best... Uh, uh, geez. Never mind. I can't. E I I can't even <laughs> think of the word for the music. Anyway, uh, Mystery Man. I saw this once a long time ago, and so I'll watch that again. And then Saving Silverman, which that's supposed to be funny too. Anyway, Dollar Piece. Also had one more as a Clint Eastwood, and that's already gone. I sold it for five. Uh, then I have a uh, Pizzazz Pizza Oven. Uh, this was six dollars today at the thrift store but uh, I already have one of these uh, they, they sell used on uh, Amazon.com for around thirty five dollars plus shipping and uh, it's great that's why I, I tried mine out I, I loved it so I kept it the only problem is uh, they use metal metal utensils on uh, the platter which scuffed it up a little bit you can use a non-stick spray because it's a non-stick surface. I uh, wish they wouldn't have used metal on it, but... Anyway, I do that or I can get a replacement for about $10 on uh, eBay and then still sell it and still make a nice profit. Another, uh, make it $20 or so profit. And last thing I got for me, I had a garage sale last week, uh, this Amazon Kindle Fire. I can turn it on here. Probably have it upside down is why. Yep, I do. And, uh, but there's books and apps and stuff like that. Uh, paid $60. This is a second generation. It's not the Fire HD, but it is a Kindle Fire. Uh, second generation gold for $80. I paid $60. I can flip it and make it make a quick 20 but I'm going to sell my older Kindle. Uh, for forty dollars, uh, which I gave uh, eight silver half dollars for, that I paid four dollars for the half dollars. So anyway, I'll still be getting this for like uh, twenty-four dollars. Not bad. I could sell them both and get back a hundred. But anyway, that's the stuff I found. Uh, Hope you like it. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, thank you for watching. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. Give me a thumbs down. I don't care. I bet I do like the thumbs up better. But uh, it's up to you. And uh, if you're not already subscribed, please subscribe. 
I'll try and get some more stuff up. It's been thin this summer. Uh, my pack rat says the same thing in the uh, Denver area. Uh, I'm in Las Vegas, and uh, he says very, very thin summer for uh, garage sales, and I agree. It's been real thin here, too. Anyway, thank you for watching. Bye.